Now, a local breast cancer survivor's story shows the significance of getting mammograms. In her very first mammogram, she was diagnosed with cancer. Local News 8 reporter Taja Davis got to meet Lisa King and see how that testing ended up saving her life. I was shocked that I had any kind of cancer, I guess. I considered myself really healthy and I took care of myself and I had nursed two babies and that was supposed to help provide protection against breast cancer. I have no family history and it, was, it came as a shock. Last year at 41 years old, Lisa King's mammogram showed she had the very early stages of breast cancer. It was the size of grains of salt, something she wouldn't be able to feel through a regular breast exam. For the family, it was a distressing experience, especially when it came to the kids. A one and a four-year-old at the time. So yeah, that was a little rough. <laughs> Knowing worst case scenarios, my little kids would grow up without a mom. I mean, that's worst case scenario. Some people die of breast cancer, and I was really lucky. But you get the opportunity to look into the abyss of losing your spouse and then being able to carry on that path and still mm -hmm. to spend the rest of your life with them. Fortunately, doctors were able to remove the cancer easily. She was out of work for four months, recovering and going to her radiation appointments five days a week for seven weeks. I slept more than normal and I was just more tired. It was definitely harder parenting whenever you have two little kids at home. And even though she and her family went through a lot, they have a calm outlook on the experience. I honestly think it's because I'm a nurse that I realize how bad things can be. Especially working in an ICU, you realize how bad it can be and I feel lucky that mine wasn't that bad. And that I'm still here and I consider myself healthy and healed. Lisa had her first follow-up mammogram a couple of months ago. Her breast tissue looked normal and cancer-free. Lisa's mammogram saved her life. In Idaho Falls, I'm Taja Davis. And as you can see there, Lisa is considered the poster child for breast cancer and mammography at Ermac. Her story also shares whether you have a family history of cancer or not. Get your mammogram or any other cancer detecting tests as soon as you can when you hit the recommended age. Cancer can happen to anybody. Well, in